All right, hello. I was going to say Aquarius, but this is a reading for Aries. So, hey, Aries, you could be dealing with an Aquarius, or Aquarius is very significant to you. Um, Or you can have Aquarius high, highly aspected. But anyways, this is going to be a reading for you for the next 48 hours. Okay. Um, Clear audience messages. I'm hearing the word duck. So are you are you about to um did I hit a tower moment? Okay, you 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 gotta pay attention. I'm hearing duck. Like you got you you'll avoid something happening if you pay attention here. Like you're ducking, like you're like you barely miss somebody swinging on you or something like that. All right. But let's see. I'm gonna go ahead and pull a card from here. Like I said, you're dealing with an Aquarius. Oh, man, I love this. All right, you got the Queen of Swords inverted here. All right, so somebody's trying to control you. Somebody wants to fight you. Is an Aquarius jealous of you, Aries? I feel like there's somebody just really upset with you or they're, I don't know, you've done something to them or they can't let something go here. Getting an Aquarius, though. Interesting. Queen of Swords in reverse is somebody who's um very manipulating, very cold, um, senseless. Okay, somebody who just wants to, um, like I said, be in control of everything. I feel like the, there's an Aquarius that's trying to tell you, trying to like trying to tell you what to do, but you're not listening, and they're getting annoyed or they're mad at you. So duck, they want to fight you. <laughs> Freaking Aries. All right, Aries. Let's see. What else is going on here for you? Yeah, I'm getting this person's really upset. Okay. They are watching you, stalking you. This is at the bottom of the deck. I just shoveled page of swords. Okay, they want to come in with quick communication or it's almost like they want they want to talk to you about something, but it, you're not wanting to hear it or it's just like you just, I don't know, you don't, you don't care or you don't you don't care what they're saying to you or what they got to say to you or what they're trying to explain i feel like they might have done something in the past to hurt you and now they're trying to come back and um like clear their name or something like that but you, you're just not in the mood to hear it i feel like because you know that they're only coming because you're doing so much better now so you know that that's why they're stalking you watching you Okay, trying to get a hold of you, trying to communicate with you because you're in a much better situation than they are. They're still stuck in their own, their own treacherous thoughts. <laughs> Let's see what else for uh, what else do we got here for Aries? Okay, Page of Cups. Yeah, could be you could possibly be dealing with um, you and this person could be dealing with an, a water sign here. I feel like you don't want to listen to them because they keep tugging on your heartstrings or they keep playing games with you or they're just not serious about you or they don't take you serious. And they kind of do the same thing over and over and over again. It's almost like when you've just about had it, when you're done, when you're done putting up with the ruckus or when you're done, like, if, when you're done just dealing with any... Like, you're just, you don't believe them. You don't believe anything they say because you know they don't mean it. With the Page of Cups in reverse, they have no, they're senseless. They have no heart with what they're saying. Or you just know that they're just talking about the ass, ass, astronomical um, point of view. <laughs> like, they're just talking up out the side of their butt. So, what to you, it's like, why do you have to sit and listen? Like, you're not going to listen to sweet nothings. Okay. But this is how this person controls you, or this is how they, I don't know, they just, they just have like a control problem, all right? It's almost like when they know that you're not in love or you don't want to pay attention to them or something anymore, then they sit here and try to fill your head with sweet lies and you're just like, yeah, 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 yeah. Heard it all before, all right? Let's see, let's go ahead and come. Let's pull another, get some more clarity cards here for you. This is pretty much a cut and dry reading. Like I said, duck, okay? They want to fight you or they want to cause... Um, they just, they just want to do anything in their power to like stay attached to you or something like that. Yeah. But don't listen to them. Seven of cups. They still have their options open. They're going to tell you that they got feelings for you, but they got feelings for other people too. Okay. So that's why you don't want to listen. Cause there's no point in listening. They're still going to keep their options open. So 
Like I said, it's almost like you guys are both dealing with the Piscean here, possibly. With the hangman at the bottom of the deck. But I, I'm getting, like, you don't want to hang around or you don't want to deal with this situation anymore because they're always going to put you as, like, another option or something like that. So, you know, I just hear you. I just, I don't know. I see you just kind of standing there looking at them, dumb, like, you're just dumbfounded. Like, you're really going to sit here and try to, like, prove prove a point that you've already proved you've proved the fact that you don't want to be with me but you're still sitting here saying that you do and all your actions and everything else shows that you don't okay you still want to keep your options open you, you want to have your cake and eat it too and you're not you're not falling for it okay the gig is up all right let's see what else here yeah they're gonna try re really really hard to um they're going to try whatever they can to persuade you into believing that, you know, that there's feelings there for you, that they feel some type of, it's gone. They don't feel anything. They just, they have their attachments to you. Okay. They're very codependent in this situation. Nine of swords. Yes. Everything I say is true. Okay. They, they're, if you take them back or if you listen to them or whatever they're saying, they're not, they, they don't mean it or they're going to just hurt you again. It's going to continue to be a cycle here. If you just, if you continue to um, entertain this situation, Aries, so use your discernment. I feel like you know better, okay? Okay, as above, so below. So you already know whatever this person, instead of like getting even with them, you're just gonna let this whole situation go, okay? You're gonna let them go and be happy because you know that once you let them go and you're happy for them, you'll attract somebody who you need who's gonna make you happy, okay? So you're trying to... You're trying to really, uh, what's the word or what do I want to say? You're trying to like be fair in the situation, even though you know that they're not, okay? You're st still trying to keep it fair game. Good for you, Aries. Way to take the high road. Because <sighs> some people won't. This Aquarian really won't. You know, they just want to control you. They want to make sure that like they're involved in all your, your dreams and aspirations and your goals. And to you, you're just like, yeah, you're not. And that's just, that's you being an Aries, okay? I feel like you're going to, they're going to come to you on Monday, so tomorrow. Hey, they're going to do everything they can to try to persuade you and convince you. Like, don't believe their convention, convi convictions, right? You were They were right to be wrong, but they're still wrong. Wrong is still wrong. All right? So I feel like you're setting a boundary here with this person. So, yeah, set strong boundaries so that you don't have to deal with manipulative and controlling people like this. This is That's the one thing that triggers um narcissist is is the when they can't control you anymore okay and i feel like that's this person they're doing absolutely are you are dealing with the narc <laughs> all right let's see all right let's pull an oracle card for you okay flow yes find an easier path forward surrender the outcome and release your expectations okay so just let it flow like this situation of letting letting it go, let it flow. Just let it happen naturally. Don't don't try to force them to disconnect. They'll eventually disconnect from you because you're gonna be you're gonna be focused on just setting your boundaries here. It's a beautiful reading for you, Aries. I'm gonna go ahead and leave that there. Peace.